Welcome to Computer Education Unlocked channel. In today's video, I will teach you how to clone a hard disk. Suppose Windows 11 and application software are installed on a hard disk. If that hard disk is cloned with a blank hard disk, Windows 11 and application software will be installed on the blank hard disk in less time. Let's start the video. Disk cloning with Norton Ghost requires two hard disks. This disk cloning method is mainly used to install operating systems and applications on one or more computers in less time. But for the convenience of screen recording I am showing you this method using VirtualBox. You can also use VirtualBox or VMware to practice. After installing the operating system and its required applications, start the hard disk cloning process. Windows key and R to open run. Type diskmjmt.msc to open disk management. Press enter. 80 GB disk 0 is the main hard disk, where Windows 11 and applications are installed, this will be cloned. 40 GB disk 1 is a blank hard disk. Norton Ghost Bootable ISO. Open the highlighted website. Scroll down. You can download any of these three ISOs. This is the password of the file to be downloaded. Click on user drive link. Create download link. Tick on I'm not robot. Click on create download link. Click to download to start Norton Ghost ISO RAW file. The password for the downloaded RAW file is 123. Right click on RAW file. Go to RAW. Click extract here. Enter password. 1, 2, 3. Click OK. Double click to open the Symantec folder. The ISO file of Norton Ghost can be found here. Then you need to download Rufus. Download. Double click Rufus to open it. Click on select option. Select the ISO file and open it. Click on start. OK. The ISO file will be copied to the pen drive and become bootable. Press F12 for boot menu. Select pen drive. Press enter. Restart the computer. Press enter. Click OK. Go to local. Click on disk option. Click on to disk. Here you have to select the source drive. I will select the 80 GB hard disk because it has the operating system and application software installed. Click OK. Now I will select the destination drive. Here I will do the 40 GB blank hard disk because the operating system and application software of the source drive will be completely cloned to it. Click OK. The destination drive will be partitioned the same way the source drive is partitioned. Click OK. It will ask for a confirmation. Proceed with disk clone. Destination drive will be overwritten. Clicking yes will start disk cloning. It will take some time to complete. Reset computer. Disk management will show that the two hard disks have the same partition and same data. Then I will remove the 80 GB hard disk. Click on setting. Select storage option. Right click on 80 GB hard drive. Click remove attachment. Click OK. The system is running from a clone 40 GB hard disk. If you like the video, please subscribe the channel and click on the bell icon to get latest video updates. If you have any questions or suggestions about the video, please comment. Subscribe now and press the bell icon. Never miss an update.